Well, today I'm going to give Lou, our cat, a lime sulfur dip. But I found out that you didn't actually have to put her in water because our cat Lou here is absolutely hates water. Like she'll claw your face off and eat your head. She will do anything. I mean, don't let her old age fool you. She's crazy. So anyway, I, you know, went on the old interweb and found out that you can actually, instead of dipping her, put it in a spray bottle and spray it and it gives the same result. So um, I'm just trying to relax her so she'll stay on the table while I explain what I got here. Well, I don't know if I'll be able to. First off, safety first, they suggest that you wear some safety goggles. Put your hair up if you have a long hair, tie it up. Um, they also recommend, nope, you're good, old girl. Putting on some rubber gloves. Oh my gosh, I'm fogging up. Of course, it just rained. I haven't had rain in like weeks. In the morning, I'm shooting outside, it rains. All right, gloves on. She knows something's up. Um, one trick that I have is I know when I put the cone on our cat, she goes pretty much docile. So I'm gonna use that to my advantage today. All you need to do is mix four ounces of water with 7.5 milliliters of this lime sulfur dip. <laughs> I'll squirt that right in there. They also suggest using a tub, but I have one here just in case, but we're gonna see if I can't just do it over this towel with the cone. For now, I'm gonna put the cone on because she's getting a little restless. She knows something's up. Here we go, girl. Slip that over your head. Of course, it's not moving in. It's right, girl. Okay, here we go. Just about done. More. Oh, get that in there. Clip. And Lou has a halty, so it'll be a little bit easier for holding her too, I thought. Okay, package secure. Okay, girl. I'm just gonna hold you there. And I'm gonna take my solution and pour it into my spray bottle while holding the cat with the halty. Okay, it's okay. It's okay, girl. Oh, she knows something's up. She totally knows something's up. Okay, I know. Maybe I will try putting her in here. There you go. All yeah, right. Oh my gosh, this is already going crazy. I haven't even started. Okay. Okay. Shh. It's okay. Okay. Maybe I'll put it in. Okay. This is going crazy. Oh, another thing. Why do I have the cotton swabs in this? It's to get her head. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna give it a mix. Oh jeez. Wish me luck. She hates this sound. And then it says just to start spraying. So, I don't know if there's a better way to start, but here I go. They said it will stink and that you're supposed to kind of get it right in. Kills all the funguses and such. And they said you're supposed to. They said you're supposed to try to be really quick. And I can see why. I know my cat. It's okay, girl. Oh my goodness. I should have worn something over my head. Okay. It's okay. Oh my goodness. It's like turning her yellow. spread this towel out a little better. I know. I'm sorry, girl. Let's try to get your butt area. Tail, you want to get all her whole body covered really good. So you kind of just have to mix it into. I know. I'm sorry. You really want to get it in deep in those areas that you think it might be really infected. Why are you asking, does she have this sulfur dip? Well, this is just because she has, she's an old cat and she has kind of 
a, they think it's like a fungus on her skin, so they recommended this sulfur dip. And it's very quite price efficient, like it didn't cost very much. And you're supposed to definitely dilute it, you can't put it on straight. Okay, girl, so done. Let me get your friend. Oh my goodness. This is going a lot better than how I pictured, to be honest. Okay, hey girl, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, girl. See if we can't get your belly. Can you get your belly. I know. Mm, poor girl. I don't even know when the last time we tried giving her a bath. Usually she's really good, but in her old age, I don't know what happened. She kind of got. All right, so I only have a little bit left. What I'm gonna do is gonna put it back in here, and then I'm gonna dab her face. Okay, go. Now this is gonna be interesting. They said you should really try to get in. Oh my goodness, this is gonna need more than that. Cotton ball. Soak it in there. They said don't get it in her eyes. Definitely get it in her ears. You want to kill all that nasty stuff. On her nose. Here's her chin. Put some on my hands. I'm just gonna go at her. Girl, I feel so bad that she's in a comb, but she's being such a trooper. Oh my goodness, I hope this works. Another thing they said is you're supposed to retreat um, in about five days. So in five days, I'm going to do the process all over again and hopefully this helps to alleviate some of that itch. And I think we are pretty much done, girl. Let's see. You're pretty well covered. So they said to leave the cone on until just a little bit more so I'm just gonna pour it up here on her and I can rub it in they said to leave the cone on until it's dry and that's it so hopefully that makes a little bit of a difference all right girl go put you down <laughs> Seriously, I just looked inside, like where are the two, are they hiding? 
Wallace. <gasps> oh. I have no idea. I know that there was a lot of people here earlier today and I have no idea why they would leave our gate open. They know we have two dogs. I checked the house and I have no idea where they are. Hopefully I can find them and I don't have to call in and get them to come home from work. Thank goodness I... Oh my god guys, everyone just say a prayer for me. I'm gonna go see if I can't find them. They couldn't have got too far because I literally just saw them. Everyone, please say a prayer for me. Oh my gosh, where are they? 